A decade after NATO bombs fell on Belgrade, the Serbian capital still shows deep battle scars. It is also a vibrant and colorful place. Bringing that creative spirit are people like Nenad Filipovic, who came back to Serbia five years ago after studying and working at Harvard. He and his team at BioIRC, a university spin-off south of Belgrade, want to chart the unique way blood moves through the architecture of the heart. For example, this is carotid bifurcation, and uh, we locate, for example, the current stage in the patient. And then, uh, then we run the particle methods to simulate the chemical process inside the plaque. And we have, for example, simulation of plaque growing. BioIRC is testing a combination of imaging, particle modeling, blood data, and software processing to predict the rate at which plaques grow in coronary arteries. These plaques can cause heart attacks. Accurately predicting growth rates and location of these plaques would be very useful information for a cardiologist. Filipovic also wants to make animated cardiovascular maps to better plan angioplasty and placement of mesh stents. Also there are new stents with uh, drug eluted stents from Boston Scientific. Filipovic has an engineering background, and optimizing stent placement is, in a way, an engineering challenge. Better visualization will help. The BioIRC crew is not alone. There's a spirit of invention in Serbia, going back to the days Nikola Tesla called it home. Maybe after recent years of too many marching boots, a new beat's starting to be heard here in the Balkans. Reporting from Belgrade for Spectrum, I'm Michael Dumiak.